Hello guys, how are you doing? Guillaume here at NAM 2019. I'm at the Rev booth with Dan. Hey Dan, how are you doing? Good man, thanks for coming by. Thanks for taking the time. Uh, this is super exciting. Absolutely. This is, Absolutely. all right, run us, what is it? Okay, so this is the uh, newest addition to our Dynamis series line. Uh, we wanted to go after something that was smaller, lighter, um, lunchbox style amplifier, and so that's what we've done here. Um, we've also added things like um, speaker IRs, virtual cabinets with uh, two notes technology behind it. And so it's built right in, allows you to essentially travel with this amplifier or to anything you would essentially do now where you would want to drop the cabinet essentially and just run it uh, through an output that gives you the opportunity at uh, just a diverse amount of cabinets and it's all built in, so. This is amazing, man. You guys are the first, is the, yeah, I mean. <laughs> absolutely. We wanted to raise the bar. It's, it's kind of what I've been doing for the last little while is just trying to go above and, and give people more of what technology has to offer in this day and age. And so that's what we've done here. We've been kind of working side by side with Tunos for a long time. We really dig their products and uh, it became available to us to put it into our amplifier. And so this is the one we uh, came up with. It is definitely a tube amplifier, um, completely tube. It's a one channel amplifier with uh, the ability to uh, push and pull in the gain knob to kind of take you from a clean sound to more crunchy sound. Uh, three band EQ, it's got the, the wattage selection that we offer on all the other amplifiers. In this case, it's, it's a 20 watt amplifier, which you can bring down to four. Um, effects loop built into the thing. And, uh, and then after that, uh, the power section runs six V6 tubes. And then after that, we can go into the two note stuff, which then takes us into our cabinet impulses. And yeah. then anything. And then anything. <laughs> and so I tried to keep it somewhat basic on the front panel, just offering uh, six, uh, six selections. Essentially, most people can probably find what they need in six selections if they were doing touring uh, gigs and whatnot. So I put that there. But the two note stuff will allow you to use MIDI, which then opens up to the, the vast array of yeah. the cabinets they have in their library. Um, but in most cases, six would probably get you by. Uh, it also offers a headphone jack on the front for people that you know play in an apartment, have to keep it quiet. And the headphones come off of the two-note stuff as well, so you get the sound of the cabinet that right. you, you've selected in this case. Whoa. Yeah, very exciting stuff. On the back, we feature uh, the balanced output, which then, like I say, comes off the two-note stuff. Um, and then you can run to mixing console, front of house, stuff like that, and not require a uh, speaker cabinet. Uh, to get by that, because it's a tube amplifier, I've put in an internal internal load into the amplifier, so you can push that in. The, the tubes get what they need, so that you're not gonna harm your output transform or your tubes, and then allow you to select your cabinet, only your cabinet, which you can then run out to wherever you need it. And then, the two notes uh, remote software. This is where things get interesting. Yeah. With the USB connection here, you plug it into your computer, you can then go into the remote software and choose any cabinet that they offer, power amp sections they offer, the effects and the whole works, and program that into either the six selectors, the six selection switch on the front, or yeah. into the memory of that two notes technology that's now built in here. <laughs> and then in that case, if you wanted to get even higher that, you use the MIDI and you could probably select nice. hundreds of cabinets, oh whatever God. you needed. Depending on your rig, of course, yeah. you know, what you're running on your pedal board and whatnot. It's a pedal um, platform type amplifier, which also has an effects loop, and that's also tube, so um, it does it all. It I mean, does it all. It could go it's... into your overhead in an airplane, and it's weighing in at nine pounds. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> this is sick, man. This is amazing. Awesome. And it is a pedal. It, I, I, you know what? This almost made me forget what we were running into that amp. <laughs> right, absolutely. It is a pedal platform, and, and yeah, we've been running pedals through it. And we have been, the, sure. The new Rev G4. Yes.
So the G4 definitely is um, not an upgrade to the G3. The G3 is still its own um, exclusive sound. Um, these pedals are based off of our generator series. So the generator 120, my very first amplifier, I wanted to take um, the sound out and put it into a little box so people could essentially get the rev sound for uh, even a more affordable price. But not only that, a lot of people want something smaller. They don't want a big head like this, but they want that sound. So now you can select between those two, two channels and get something smaller like this to run it through or whatever you need. Essentially, it, it's a preamp um, that it's... The difference between it and the G3 is quite substantial in tone, actually. You really have to play it to experience it. But uh, it's it's uh, taken right from the generator series of channels, so I'm very excited about that one too. Yeah, there's, yeah. There's I mean, this is here. this is a lot. Absolutely. This is a lot. This yeah. is a big year for you guys. I'm, it is. I'm super excited for you. I am too. It's gonna be great. Thank you so much. Oh. Thank you for taking the time. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Um, this was Dan at the Rev booth. My name is Guillaume. This is the Toman channel. <laughs> Thank you again and be good to one another. Bye, guys.